that means 2 to 1 decrease the hormone so definitely it is a state of reduction so what i mean to say is that addition of a more electronegative element removing of hydrogen is called oxidation there are number of examples on this you can observe this one examples similarly what happened addition of hydrogen removing of a more electronegative elements can be called as reduction reaction now both if that takes place then the reaction is called what redox reaction now let me observe here now let me see the same example we'll take next example now let me take this problem here okay. in the reactions given below identify the species undergoing oxidation and reduction now which species undergoing oxidation and reduction now if you see this reaction is called redox reaction now we have to identify which is oxidation reaction and which is reduction reaction based upon whatever the definitions now here for this one h2s if you observe in h2s converting into sulfur correct or i am writing over here in this case i am writing over here h2s h2s converting into sulfur beta now loss of hydrogen or not minus hydrogen or not correct or not beta yes sir hydrogen so which reaction beta it is oxidation, oxidation. so in this uh, which is undergoing oxidation h2s is undergoing oxidation now if h2s1 undergo oxidation remaining will undergo reduction now what is the reduction you see chlorine now how chlorine is converting you see cl2 converting into hcl if you balance you can make two moles now addition of how many hydrogens here two hydrogens now definitely chlorine undergoing here what reduction reaction so by seeing the species okay present in the reaction we can easily identify which is h2s is oxidized okay now chlorine is reduced h2s is oxidized right but if you observe here what happened if you observe here what happened this one second one second one if you observe let me take the second one what is given here fe3o4 fe3o4 uh, converting into what here iron beta right S next aluminum converting into what beta here al2 now easily you can say which is undergoing oxidation which is undergoing reduction can you say beta now here anybody first one you say this one oxidation or reduction beta first one this one so reduction loss of oxygen no reduction reduction right you are losing minus oxygen over here therefore definitely it is what reduction reaction r for reduction now here it is what oxidation reaction because you are adding oxygen i think everyone is understood i think right now what about the second one third one beta third one In third reduction. one ha sodium added with hydrogen okay now sodium is what here oxidation or reduction reaction if you observe so third one so what the given if you observe here With the careful application of the concept of electronegativity, only we may in infer that sodium is oxidized and hydrogen is reduced. Reaction three chosen her prompts us to think in terms of another way to define the redox reaction. Now, what I am saying, you don't understand this one. What I am saying here, if you observe this reaction, third reaction, you can say what type of reaction it is. What type of reaction it is. you are saying what type of reaction beta just now told me addition of hydrogen reduction reaction correct or not beta based upon the definition what we can say beta third one 
for sodium addition of hydrogen this type of reaction beta reduction, reduction. correct or not but this reaction is not at all reduction reaction this is not a reaction reduction reaction of course hydrogen added but it is not reduction reaction. why because when hydrogen added to more electronegative element then it will be reduction but here hydrogen added is to what less electronegative element if you observe what happened sodium is less electronegative than the hydrogen this is more electronegative which one hydrogen is more electronegative so when you add hydrogen to less electronegative element which one is less electronegative element beta sodium the sodium is less electronegative so when you add hydrogen to sodium then the reactions will not be reduction so you are getting some type of what contradictions there are some limitations are there so this concept does not work see we need another concept another way to define the redox reactions let me see what are they actually so we have already learned yeah we have already learned that the reactions see, see more electronegative more electronegative more electronegative okay now these reactions are oxidation reactions but hydrogen you are not getting why because hydrogen when is metal it is minus so what we'll do here we'll do one more concept here. let let we think in terms of electrons now so leave it what oxygen leave it what here hydrogen or leave it electronegative you will get many confusion if you see what happen if you take addition of hydrogen addition of oxygen removing of electronegative element addition of electronegative element you will get many confusions to avoid the confusion in terms of electron we can say oxidation reduction reactions now what is oxidation reaction beta very simple loss of electron if any species losing electron okay then the reaction is called oxidation and the substance is called what reducing element reverse we can we can take it. reduction means what here gain of electron let me see this one reduction means what gain of electrons oxidation means loss this is also i think you know everything very simple concept is now when you, you observe this one better let me observe this one this example will take it sodium this reaction i am writing over here I am writing over sodium chlorine reaction. I am writing. So first of all, when sodium reacts with chlorine, right, gives rise to sodium chloride. To balance this one, here two chlorines are there. I have taken here two. Here I have taken two. Now it is a balanced chemical reaction. Now when you observe here, the oxidation state of any element always will be zero, right? the oxygen state i am writing over here zero for this one also will be zero any element if you observe either sodium potassium oxygen anything in elemental state the oxidation state will be zero once they form a molecule now how it is forming a molecule here sodium is giving one electron to the chlorine but two sodiums are there each will give one electron okay now which is donating electrons beta sodium now sodium giving electrons to the chlorine now sodium is losing electron you observe here what happened what is the definition loss of electron now sodium losing electron now sodium undergoing which reaction beta oxidation reaction so conversion of this one is called what type of reaction here oxidation reaction now chlorine is gaining electron correct or not when chlorine is abstracting the electrons from the sodium that means chlorine is gaining electron now this reaction Can be called as what reduction reaction, right? Now both are taking place. Oxidation is taking place from sodium side. Reduction is taking place from chlorine side. Now this reaction is collectively called as redox reaction. Redox reaction. Oxidation reduction plus oxidation. Now the oxygen state. How many electrons donated to chlorine beta? Each sodium donated how many electrons? Or how many electrons it lost? Just wait. How many electrons it lost? Are you there? Ah, okay. 
Each sodium, how many electrons last better? Each sodium, two electrons. No, two sodiums are losing two electron. Then one is losing one electron. So you can, if you lose electron, put positive beta. Put positive plus one means what? Loss of one electron. Now each chlorine, one chlorine, gaining how many electrons beta? One chlorine gaining how many electrons here? One, one. chlorine. One. So if we gain, you have to represent as a minus. How many? One. So if we gain electron, minus representation. This for what? Gain of electron. Gaining of electron. Gains electron or gaining of electron. Okay. If you put positive, means what is the meaning here? Loss of electron. For example, if I am putting what aluminum plus three indicates what aluminum lost three electrons. If I put what happened, S minus two, sulfur gained two electrons. It is more, meaning of this one is gain of two electrons. Here loss of three electrons. These are the simple, simple things only. It looks what very simple, but coming when you do problems, what happened, you will do mistakes. Next thing is that what is oxidizing agent? It is also very important for us. What is reducing agent? The substance which undergo reduction. I am writing here what? The substance which undergo reduction or the substance which accept electron. Here it is shown like this. Observe this one better. Acceptor of electron. Acceptor of electron. Any substance which accepts electron, any substance which undergo reduction, accepting of electron is nothing but oxidizing. Now, if you observe what happened, can you say among the sodium and the chlorine, which is oxidizing agent and which is reducing agent beta? Sodium and chlorine, which is oxidizing agent and which is reducing agent? Oxidizing sodium is reducing agent. Yeah, oxidizing agent means which accept electron undergo reduction. Reducing agent means which donate electron undergo which one? Oxidation reaction. Undergo oxidation reaction. Now here which is undergoing oxidation beta? Which element is undergoing oxidation among these two? Sodium. Sodium. Therefore sodium is equal what? Reducing agent. So you may get some type of questions like this. Here. Which substance is reducing agent and which substance is oxidizing agent? And chlorine undergoing reduction, therefore it is called oxidizing agent. Don't get any confusion with oxidizing agent undergo reduction. Correct or not? Now you take some more examples better. So these two examples you take here. This is the homework today for you. Okay. Now you have to write what actually. Homework is what you have to write. Now after writing this one, Oxidation reaction, reduction reaction, and which is oxidizing agent and which is reducing agent. This is the homework for you. You have to identify the oxidation reaction, reduction reaction, and you have to identify which is the oxidizing agent and which is the reducing agent. I think it's very simple or not? Is it very simple or not? Identifying it. Let me take this example better. Problem 8.2. This one also you can do. Justify that the reaction is redox reaction. You have to justify this reaction is redox reaction. How to justify this one? Same thing. If one substance undergo oxidation, other is under reduction, you can say that is what redox reaction only. So let me take this one here. I will, I will explain this one better. Now. You can also justify these three reactions also, redox reactions also. Right. Now let me see here what I what is the reaction? Sodium hydrogen. So let me see very simple better. Sodium reacting with hydrogen, giving sodium hydride, NaH. 
two moles here also two moles balanced now we have to justify this is a redox reaction now let me see first of all now what is happening is sodium converting into sodium hydride correct next thing hydrogen converting into sodium hydride correct or not now first of all you see sodium and hydrogen now here sodium is releasing electrons to hydrogen one is giving one electron two are giving two each is giving one electron now here it is gaining electron hydrogen gains electrons and sodium lose electron sodium is losing electron to a hydrogen now here oxygen state of any element will be zero okay here it is losing how many electron beta one therefore plus one hydrogen is gaining one electron minus one hydrogen again zero oxidation state now gaining how many again same thing minus one because one hydrogen gains one electron two hydrogens gain two electrons now if you observe here what happens sodium conversion of sodium into sodium hydride now loss of electron or current you observe this one beta you observe this one these things you observe now which reaction beta this one i which, which is a which is in the box sodium into sodium plus one which reaction beta oxidation oxidation right put here oxidation reaction now here this one this one beta reduction. hydrogen reduction reaction therefore you can say it is a redox reaction because what you say answer here in this case sodium is what oxidized sodium is oxidized right and hydrogen is reduced correct or not because sodium undergo oxidation therefore oxidized hydrogen is undergoing reduction therefore is reduced so if in a, in a, in a redox reaction in a redox reaction one substance undergo oxidized other undergo reduced therefore they are called what redox reaction you see sodium is oxidized hydrogen is reduced but thing is here you will get confusion when you say sodium is oxidized now sodium is what type of reagent beta oxidizing agent or reducing agent reducing agent. here generally students will get confused if you by heart what happened they will confuse you sodium is here reducing agent here reducing agent if it is oxidized if it undergo oxidation if it lose electron if it is oxidized then it is reducing agent now hydrogen is reduced here hydrogen undergo reduction hydrogen is reduced hydrogen gain electron then it is called oxidizing agent oxidizing agent always undergo what beta reduction this concept you have to remember so this is the topic today okay remaining topics will take tomorrow that is a simple topics only tomorrow means on monday okay on monday we complete the remaining topics also so what is the homework today beta for you this is the homework one this one i have given homework for you you write all these reactions separately you write this one oxidation means what in your take a notebook and write down what is oxidation see you write these definitions you write these definitions after writing the definition take one or two examples like this next what is redox reaction sorry reduction reaction you take this definition and take one or two examples over this whatever the examples are given you take definition of oxidation example definition of reduction example after that what is redox concept what is redox concept then you take this problem number 8.1 in your notebook take problem in 8.1 in your notebook after that what happen next uh, what is oxidation in terms of electrons here? in terms of electrons here what is reduction what is oxidizing agent what is reducing all definitions you write over in the notebook then after this what happen do this problem 8.2 same you note it down in the problem and take this one also 
here you have to identify what oxidizing agents and reducing agents you have to identify oxidizing and reducing agents so this is the work today here next uh, Okay, here you know you can't do anything, you just only that is the work today. Right? How many have joined today? 46 only. That means 15 students were absent today. Wait, wait, I will take attendance now. All of you wait now, I will take just attendance now. Abhishek, why Abhishek Sharma absent? Aditya, Akriti, present sir. Anshu Yadav, Anuj, present sir. Yeah. Apurva Ashif Present sir Atarva Present, sir. Atul Rawat. Ayush. Present, sir. Bharati. Present, sir. Chaitanya absent today. Dhanasri. Present, sir. Jnaneshwari. Present, sir. Gulabi. Present, sir. Kalpesh. Present, sir. Kaushal. Yes, sir. Prunal. Present, sir. Manoj. Mayur. Present, Present sir. sir. Ojas. Present, sir. Omkar. Present, sir. Present, sir. Both Omkar. M and C present. Pradamesh Tagav Rahul present sir Raj present sir Riya present sir Sahil absent today Samruddhi Sir, so you didn't take my name. Iska beta. Sir, Ramya. Ramya, liya na. Iska liya maine. Samiksha absent today. Present, sir. Hmm. Okay. Party Samiksha. Sapna. Then Sartak. Sartha absent. Shishi. Shishidhar. Present, sir. Shishi Ranjan absent. Shishi Ranjan is there. Absent. Then Sneha G. Sneha VS. Present, sir. Sonali. Present, sir. Sir, you didn't take my name. Sri Hari present, sir. Sumit M. Sumit SD. 
सूरज सी एबसेंट सूरज यू एबसेंट प्रियंबक एबसेंट उमेश वैष्णवी जाधव वामन विशाल सर यश जस्ट एम रीडिंग एबसेंट इज नेम पेटा तेजस्विनी एबसेंट सर तेजस्विनी प्रेजेंट स्वास्तिका प्रेजेंट सर प्रेजेंट सर पल्लवी ओके बेटा कुछ नाम इसमें नहीं आ रहे हैं वेदांत एबसेंट वेदांत राइट वैष्णवी एन एबसेंट वैष्णवी एन राइट नेक्स्ट प्रियंबक एबसेंट सूरज यू एबसेंट नेक्स्ट सूरज सी एबसेंट सुमित एस डी एबसेंट नेक्स्ट शशि शशिरंजन एबसेंट सार्थक एबसेंट साहिल एबसेंट चैतन्य एबसेंट अभिषेक शर्मा एबसेंट ओके बेटा यू कैन लॉग आउट नाउ थैंक यू सर ओके बेटा